I think I did what I came here to do, which is to make New Amsterdam a place of hope. Surprise! Yeah, New Amsterdam's final episode ever kicked off with that announcement. Max left the hospital to work for the World Health Organization in Geneva, Switzerland, and devote more time to his daughter. And things must have worked out, because at the end of the episode, we learn that, surprise again, Luna became New Amsterdam's medical director as an adult. Hi. I grew up at New Amsterdam. Max's decision to leave abruptly ended his relationship with Elizabeth Wilder, and that left us with two big questions for showrunner David Schulner and executive producer slash director Peter Horton. First, is it really over for Max and Elizabeth? And second, what about the hashtag sharp win of it all? Here's what Horton had to say about Wilder. We really love ambiguity, and we wanted to leave that question of his relationship with Wilder a bit in the, in the wind. You know, with him giving her the keys to New Amsterdam, they're clearly not, at this moment, together. He's going off to Geneva with his daughter. They're still in love with each other, but the future is ambiguous. When it comes to Max's ex fiance the producers did want Freema Adjuman to return for the finale as Dr. Helen Sharp. She was totally up for returning for the season finale. And again, it's our one regret that her and, you know, Anna Pum, who his character died, obviously, on the show, but we would have loved to honor those characters and actors as well in the finale, but we just couldn't make it work. We well, tried. We really did try with Rima too, just to see if we could get her, and it just didn't time out right. In the end, Schulner feels good about how the finale turned out. I think it all worked out the way it was supposed to work out because the story we had for Freema in the finale wasn't as good as what we ended up with. Head to tvline.com for more from Vlada Gelman's interview with the producers and let us know your take on the new Amsterdam series finale in the comments. For tvline.com, I'm Andy Swift.